All right, part two of this Leisure Travel Unity 24TB. Went ahead on inside. I've actually opened this up, but it's really hard to do with one hand. There's two house batteries. They're 12 volt, from what I could tell, and they're both they both seem to be with, put in on the last uh, few months or so because the date code on them is I think 923 and 11 or 1223. They look like they're fresh batteries. So there's your main disconnect. As part of doing service to a motorhome, when we put it through our service department, things like, even if this is just done recently, we have to replace the fire extinguisher, the um, smoke detector, certain things just have to be done every time. This is a lighted handle here. You have a dimmer switch to control the roof, the ceiling lights there. Coat hanger or key hanger. I noticed that all of the original documents and folder and bag that came with the coach are still here, which is great. These are some shades. I think they go to the front side windows. This coach also has a Wii Boost system, which is a cell phone booster. There's your controller for the solar, solar panel and the Wii Boost antenna. There's a Dometic safe that may or may not have come with the coach from the factory. I don't know. There's your Bluetooth stereo system and DVD player. This one's empty. I don't know if this is uh, from from uh, Leisure Travel. You'd have to tell me, but there's a nice padding that's cut out for pretty much every or most compartments that I noticed. So there's your switcher for the TV. Again, padding throughout all of those storage compartments. All of the, so far the hinges seem to be in good shape and the wood looks great. And one more compartment there. Obviously this is the setup, this furniture up here. You've got a couple of seats facing each other. Um, this is a table that will maneuver a number of ways and then open up to be a little bigger, etc. Up here, your controls, there's a, um, that's the uh, awning control, uh, tanks, generator, it started right up, 114 hours and, uh, 114 and a half hours, so real, pretty much light use of the generator. And there's your inverter there. So, I've kind of opened everything up and we'll go through and take a look. Sink, obviously good size. There's your two burner gas propane stove. I like that they got a spot for the trash can there. Good size and very clean under sink. Close these up as we go. More access here. All the drawers looking good. TV comes out. And I thought I had it on, but let's see here. Oh, it turned on a minute ago. But either way, that's a Vizio television. Probably, there it goes. Probably came with the coach, but, um, I don't see, yeah, like it doesn't have the smart channels. You'd have to get a new different TV or add a uh, fire stick or something like that to have the newer upgraded features. Nice pantry and everything looks nice and clean. The refrigerator also looks clean. And this is a good time to point out, I don't smell anything unusual in here. There's no weird odors. doesn't smell like cleaner, it just smells totally normal. Convection microwave. This is a, just about the cleaning when they did it. <clears throat> All right, come on through to the bathroom. Got an air, an attic fan there. Porcelain toilet, electronic flush. left these I'm guessing didn't, did not come with but in either way they're here this is a small storage compartment underneath there did 
didn't notice this yet, but more storage. Looks like one over here too. The mattresses look to be covered. Your hanging closets. I'm gonna close this and back up so you can see everything. Another closet here. And then all these compartments are nice and clean. Storage ready. One more over here, we didn't see. Samsung TV. Again, the older design of remote control. And then this, if you don't already know, flips over. The pads in the outside were for the, uh, to make this bed a little more complete, I believe. And uh, that's about it. Let me know if you have any other questions I didn't cover. Uh, I love that they don't have the return for the air conditioner up here. Got a couple speakers. So it makes the air conditioner a lot more quiet than normal. Here's your air conditioner control. And you've got another uh, attic fan here in the kitchen. And then this, of course, is a pop-up. And also, it closes to keep the... That's in good shape. Keep the light or heat out. And then you can pop that open and obviously close it or open up the shades so that no insects can come in or whatever. But I think that's about it. Um, let me know if I've missed anything, if you have any other questions. I'm gonna upload this for you to take a look at. And uh, talk to you soon.